Oh. Ain't no light in this hallway, but this is like a, a fucking view of my landscape here. It's it's uh, dark, but I've been working a little on this. Worked on it, I think, what, yesterday or is that two days ago? I don't know. Coming in the studio here. This shit is packed up in here, man. Oh, snap. That one is um, the spirit animal joint. Um, bear. And... Um, Gosh, it's kind of getting old already, you know, it's, it's, but it's, I still think it's really good, but I need to go shoot. I need to go back in and paint that gold to brown kind of, um, you know, gradation, maybe come back and do some of those. The blues really pop. The reds don't. So the reds need to pop some more. And then over here, we got that joint, Marina. Down below is the, the battle painting. And, um, oh, who's that dude? Oh, I don't know. Um, dude, Breakthrough. I just added a little bit of, not Breakthrough. Um, what did I call this painting? Vision or something. I added a little bit of this, like, crazy. Th but they are are little like drops that's like when you when a drop of rain drops in the water like the splash that comes up and they're all over the place they're like that's in the ground uh there's you know elephant is getting old this one i posted a while ago two two figures or something uh it get these are my <laughs> i never really show these some days i'm gonna show these it's a triptych I started a long time ago, but they're so, this one's pretty fat. It's called black, white, or Indian. We're all equal. And if you know those lyrics, you, I don't need to explain them. Anyway, so this was the um, bear. And I'm, I put, I just took this out. Man, I haven't touched this in like, shoot, over a month. Well over a month, probably two months. And this is a new joint. This one, excuse the reflection, is uh, is gonna be really freaking crazy. Um, these are these are sort of new, sort of new. This is brand pretty much brand new, uh, but a new a new idea, a new approach on this one, where the drawing definitely goes off the edges. It's it's in that that communicates just infinity, you know, like it just goes on forever. And, and the, um, can't get that glare out of there to save my life. I'm trying to cover it, but it ain't working. Is that the one? I guess the glare is from over here. Anyway, so that one is, um, is going to have a million little windows in it like little spots of light. It's a painting about consciousness. Oh, and so is this one over here? Oh, fuck. Excuse me, pardon my language. Um, this is like a, a failed painting and then I painted over it and now I finally feel like the white is the beginning of a third painting on here. And once again, we have that same kind of drop water um, concept. It, but this one shows a lot of uh, more, perhaps, dimension. Obviously, the the um, ellipses, whatever they are, uh, concentric elliptical things. And then up top are these waves. And they go across, and then they kind of curve up as they go back in space. So it's it's I really like how that worked out. I might even do a painting alone of that, of the waves and stuff. Oh, and this one down here is pretty crazy. Um, this one's going to be bananas. This one over here, I thought I was having str uh, trouble with. And I was able to bring it out. Because it was a thing that, uh, like this wonderful idea I thought I had. And I was like, oh yeah, let's let's go with that. Like with the abstract painting underneath. And then you draw over it, as you can see the black lines. And then I was going to paint the colors that come from the outside behind 
and go behind the line drawing, they were going to change colors as they go across the line drawing and then back to the original color when they come to a space in the line drawing, la la la. I did the same thing up here with this painting up top. And both of these paintings, I was like, I left them for a while. See, like I I have took a break from painting from like August to the end of October, middle of August to the end of October. And these paintings were like, in a in a decently progressed stage, but the the concept or not the concept, but the technique I was going to use to paint, you know, finish them, execute them. I just explained it kind of like obviously as got all this abstract painting in the background. That's something I've done before, obviously. And now like as the the wavy lines come in and go behind this drawing right here, which is not too visible. It's like got a white outline with a black outline. And then the colors change as they go in. That is a serious undertaking in terms of like, um, not easy to do, but it's, it, it's, it's not easy to do when you do such fine line work. And the colors are so many and so not as thick. If you had thick, like in this one, I'm kind of, making them thick like these big brush strokes here and um i'm making it easier on myself and I'm, I'm making it so that i could finish the darn painting this is you know i posted this this is uh tiki or not tiki what a idol or figure this one is is bananas as well i got all these like cheap frames that i use i got them for free and um all these 30 by 40 paintings, it's like a thing, and I love it. It's a great size. And I also want to do a larger painting, which is, um, you know, 60 by 80. Haven't gotten that yet. But I did get a 50, what was it, 68 inch by 46 inch stretcher frame today, which... Um, 50, 68 inches happens to be my height and uh, which is nice. This is uh, Leslie finished. Love this one. Uh, here's a couple of little small joints. This one I got to um, work some more. This is one of my abstract underpaintings. It's not going to look like this. I'm going to put some of my drawings over it and and then do what I do. Uh, here's the smaller canvas. It's interesting shit going on there. Um, this one I'm really feeling. This is an old painting that I painted right over. Yeah, I do that a lot. Um, uh, I think I posted it on Instagram. Actually, I don't know what I called it. But now we got this like, this like, it looks like a monkey, like with his arms up and stuff. And he's like got these little legs underneath him. And uh, I just think it's a, I thought that was a great drawing. It has a lot of activity action and uh I'm, I'm gonna roll with that oh and then up there yeah um this is sort of new too small little joint haven't really worked too much on it but this is believe it or not somewhat of a self-portrait uh i i don't know how i could think of a self-portrait but it kind of is all right that's it this is my studio room jam-packed with stuff 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 all over the place and i only got more to come word is bond peace out people one love, one consciousness, yes. <laughs>